A sold-out signal in Duna Park for the meeting of Borussia Dortmund and Freiburg. Dortmund top of the table knowing going into this game that a win here would put them eight points clear of closest rivals Leverkusen after their early defeat to Bayern Munich in the afternoon. Freiburg with nothing really to play for this season. They're not in any danger of getting relegated. We join the game in the 23rd minute and it's the home team as you'd expect on the attack. Schmelzer with a good burst down the left. Gets the ball back eventually to Mario Goetze and the 18-year-old opens the scoring with his sixth of the season. Jurgen Klopp giving him a big round of applause for getting the game going to the liking of the home fans. Lewandowski taking out two defenders, leaving Goetze with all the time in the world to put it past Oliver Baumann. He got his debut against Dortmund. They got beaten on that occasion as well. At the other end, there was not a lot happening. The free kick from Schuster easily dealt with. Then the ball long. Goetze gets the shot across the goal and then Lewandowski and Gorskoitz getting in each other's way. That could easily have been the next goal just a couple of minutes after the first one. Good running from Goetze gets behind the defender. Jendrysek allowing Goetze to get that pass across the face of the goal. Jurgen Klopp thought that one was going to be number two, as did most of the home fans. Then, just four minutes later, another attack for Dortmund. Grosskreutz and Tony da Silva, who'd been substituted on for the injured Nuri Shahin, get the ball to Blasiakowski. Blasiakowski with the shots, and Oliver Baumann with the save. He had a very busy afternoon, did Oliver Baumann. Coming through the legs of the defender, he did well to get behind it. 36 minutes gone, Goethe causing more trouble with Da Silva, then Schmelzer with the cross. Lovely touch on from Gorskois, quick feet from Lewandowski, but the shot not in the back of the net. Lovely little touch from Gorskois, change of feet for Lewandowski, but just wide of the upright. Five minutes before the break, Piszczek with the throw in. Gorskoitz and Kali Jury getting in the way. Then De Silva gets it over the top to Lewandowski, and his effort not far off. There was only one way traffic in this game. Dortmund completely in control, even when Freiburg were on the attack. Kali Jury losing out to Hummels. Top rack with the mistake, and Lewandowski keeps his head, goes around the keeper, and scores his seventh goal of the season. That was 2-0 Dortmund just before the break. Dortmund have won their last three home games against Freiburg. And didn't concede a single goal in the process. And they were on their way to achieving that result again if they continued in that fashion. So half-time, well, there's no doubt that the Dortmund fans are dreaming of winning the title. And they looked well on their way in this game. 56 minutes gone, corner from De Silva. Piszczek trying to gently nudge the ball between the goalkeeper and the defender on the back post, but didn't get enough on it. And another chance went begging. But the chances were many. Another effort here from Kevin Gorskoitz, leaning back just a little bit in the shot and putting that one into the 39th row. Shinji Kagawa still injured, the Japanese international who set the Bundesliga alight in the first half of the season. Maybe we'll get to see him before the end of this season. Just past the hour mark, another chance. Lewandowski shooting wide. He had so many chances in for the injured Lucas Barrios. He's got a muscle strain. Lewandowski likes to play up front in that role. Not hitting the target on that occasion. Seven minutes later, once more Dortmund on the attack. Gorskoitz. Blasiakowski with a dainty little touch getting in front of Heiko Butcher. But again, somehow the goal not coming. Scored a late one against Hamburg last weekend. And as the crowd got behind their team even more, if it was at all possible, the third goal of the game finally went in and it was an easy tap-in for Kevin Gorskoitz. 
Mario Goetze providing horse points with his eighth goal of the season to make it 3-0. All smiles at Dortmund at the moment. They seem to be able to do no wrong. Perfect timing with the run. The two yellow shirts springing the offside trap. Bauman once more with absolutely no chance whatsoever of getting anything on that. Freiburg completely played out of the game by a rampant Borussia Dortmund. A young team with a lot of talent. The last chance that Freiburg had, and only their second of the game, came three minutes before the end. Cissé, top scorer until this weekend. Basically summing up Freiburg's afternoon. Weidenfeller made a great save. Cissé will not want to look at the replay of his attempted volley. So, nothing to be done except celebrate for the Dortmund fans. They'd had a great afternoon's entertainment as they storm towards the title. 3-0, the final score. But they'll be talking about this season for years and years to come. Dortmund unstoppable.